and the words are just go. Hi everyone, so today's Silk Laminar is all about the smoky eye using our Christmas pack Sultry Eyes. So for the perfect angled eyeshadow, I like to stick a little bit of sticky tape um, following my lower lash line, connecting up to my top lash line, and that's just going to give us the perfect angle for our eyeshadow. Next I take an eye contour brush, and this is a really crucial step. So I use an Argan bronzer in dark to warm up my crease as a transition colour. If you have fair skin, you go ahead and use the medium or a light bronzer. Um, but just anything that's really going to warm up that crease and prepare the blending to happen with the black shadow that we're going to apply after. Then just continue to blend with the flat angle of that brush. Take the Argan eyeliner out of your sultry pack and line the top of your lash line with that black Argan liner. I like to do a really thick black line. It doesn't have to be really neat because we're going to smudge it in a minute. Um, but yeah, I just line both sides of my eyes right to the angle of the sticky tape. And then what I do is I take a smudge eyeshadow brush and I just smudge that um, liner up into my eyelid. And that's going to give us a really perfect base for our shadow and it's going to give us that gorgeous gradient smoky effect. I know it can be daunting with black eyeshadow and trying to do these smoky eye looks, but the key is just to take your time. There's no rush. Just blend away slowly until you get the perfect look. Taking that same eyeliner, I'm going to line my top lash line to add more dimension to the eye. Then I'm going to take the Soft and Smoky palette from our Christmas pack and I'm going to use a silk blending brush to apply that matte black colour to my eye from the base of my lash line up towards the transition colour that we put there earlier. Uh, and you just want to pat this black colour all the way up into the crease area just so it blends nicely with that transition colour. The next important step is to take a clean eye contour brush and blend away any harsh lines. You really want that black colour to blend perfectly into our transition colour. Now for the really fun stuff, take a small eyeshadow brush and take that grey silvery colour out of the palette and I'm going to pop that on the inner half of my eye and this is a gorgeous colour. I love the metallic just really pops with this black eyeshadow and then I'm just going to work it in on the inner half of my eye blending up towards the crease and then what we're going to do is going to take that light shadow we're going to put it on the center of the eyelid and that's just going to give a pop of light in that area. Then take your silk blending brush and just blend away any harshness. Now it's the time for the big reveal and we can take away the tape. If there's any smudging or makeup peeling then you just take your silk blending sponge and blend away any harshness. Then I'm going to take some of that grey again and just pop it in the inner half of my eye because I really love it and it just makes this eyeshadow look look so beautiful. Then I'm going to take my trusty Argan liner in black and I'm going to line my lower waterline and my top waterline just to exaggerate that sultry eye and the angle of the eye that we created with the sticky tape earlier on. Then I'm going to take that black colour um, and I'm just going to work that into the lower lash line using an angled eye brush. And this is just going to lock in the eyeliner from running and it's just going to further define and smoke up this gorgeous eye look. And as you can see that's starting to look really harsh on my lower lash line. So what I like to do is take that Argan bronzer or that same transition colour we used earlier and I like to blend that colour into the lower lash line and just blend out that black shadow. This gives us that really sultry eye. Then I'm going to use that angled brush again and I'm going to take that black shadow and I'm just going to line the top lash line with that just to give a little bit more definition and to open up the eyes a little bit because with black shadow looks like this it can tend to close the eye. So it's really important to define your lash line. And finally it's time to use our fiber lash mascara kit from our pack. What we're going to do is we're going to take the defining mascara and we're going to coat our top lashes and this is going to act as a glue for our fibers. And we're just going to put the fibers from the mid lengths to the ends of our lashes and that's going to give us that full dramatic um, false lash effect. And I just like to repeat for my bottom and then my other eye. Um, and then I'm going to go ahead and do my eyebrows. Of course I'm using my silk fibers for my eyebrows because that's what gives me the most natural hair-like effect. And I just like to feather stroke through my brows until I get the arch that I want. And that's it for today's look using our sultry eye pack. I'm sorry my camera died so these are some photos of the after look. I really hope you enjoyed today's silk laminar and I'll see you all next time. Bye!